let's navigate to the bank update screen. So we've logged in. We're on the first page you'll see after you log in to Oracle I Expense. Just under the navigator bar here, there are two or possibly more links depending on your access rights. We want SAH MOPD Bank Update. Let's click on that link now. This will take you to the Employee Bank Update self-service page. And you can see there are three fields here that we can edit with the existing information already populated. If you'd like to change the BSB, you can do that in one of two ways. So we can either start typing the BSB number if we're already aware of that into the existing field. And if we wait a second or two, a list of all the possible options will appear in a pop-up drop-down menu there and we can select one of those. Or we can use the magnifying glass icon. A pop-up will appear and we can do a similar thing. We can search by BSB or partial BSB. If it is partial BSB, we will need to use the wildcard characters, the percentage signs on either side of that number. We can click go and a list will appear. We can also search by bank and branch. So if we're looking for a Commonwealth Bank, again using the wildcard characters, just in case there are characters either side of the bank and branch name. And we've got a list of options to choose from there. So if we did want to choose one of those options, we can click, uh, click the quick select option. And there it appears there. To change the account number, we simply type in our account number and account name. Once we're happy with the changes, click update. And we'll receive this message here. Data saved successfully, but it says these changes may take up to a day to become effective. So that means that if you navigate out of the page, let's go to home in the top right here. So clicking the home link, taking us back to this home page. If we navigate back into the bank update section, our old details will appear, but rest assured the details that you inputted before receiving that data save successfully message will be updated. That's how you update your bank account details in iExpense.